Hi there, I'm Rami from Ledger, and today I'm going to introduce Ledger Sync and explain how to activate it across your devices. Most people want to manage their digital assets on different devices, and they want to see the same information sync across them. This is easy to do if you share your information with a service provider, but difficult if you want to retain the self-sovereignty of your data. Ledger Sync is your solution. It allows you to sync Ledger Live across your devices while keeping ownership of your data. In this video, I'm going to cover everything you need to know about Ledger Sync, so let's get started. Ledger Sync is a feature of Ledger Live that allows you to sync your accounts across devices. This might sound simple, but what makes Ledger Sync unique is it allows you to sync your data without sharing it with anyone, including Ledger. Before Ledger Sync, the only way to ensure your accounts were consistent across devices was to update each one manually. Not ideal, but it was better than creating a solution that synced your data by storing it in a database that you didn't control. We fundamentally believe that no one should have access or ownership over your data but you. And this is why we created Ledger Sync. Ledger Sync uses the Ledger Keyring protocol because it is the only way to let you sync data across devices and retain self-sovereignty. Most Web2 services provide a synced user experience. Take Google Photos. I can access my photos between devices because they are stored on a Google server. At Ledger, we decided to take a different approach. The Ledger Keyring protocol is a way to create encryption keys with your secret recovery phrase. You can use these keys to encrypt the data on your device. Then, if you want to share this data securely, you can send it, and if you share the encryption key, the recipient can decrypt the data. This process allows you to completely sync the changes in your transaction history from one device with Ledger Live installed to another automatically and securely without sharing your data with Ledger or anyone else. Let's run through how to set up Ledger Sync on a desktop and a mobile device. Starting with your desktop, connect your Ledger device and open Ledger Live. Go to Settings and under General, choose Ledger Sync and Manage. Then unlock your Ledger device and open the Ledger Sync app. Then on Ledger Live Desktop, click Turn on Ledger Sync. Follow the on-screen prompts and you're done. Now that it's set up, you have the option to sync with another Ledger Live app. Click on this and you should see a QR code to set up Ledger Sync on your mobile. Open the Ledger Live app on your mobile. Go to Settings and under General, choose Ledger Sync and turn on Sync. You'll be prompted to choose between Scan QR Code or Use My Ledger Device. In this tutorial, we will choose Scan QR Code. You will be initially prompted to allow the Ledger Live app access to your camera. Tap Allow and let's go on. You can now scan the QR code on your desktop with your phone camera through the Ledger Live app. Now, a three-digit code will appear on your Ledger Live desktop, and you can enter this into your Ledger Live app. This process takes about 30 seconds. You can now use your Ledger Live between your mobile and desktop with them securely synced. In this video, we covered all the steps involved in setting up Ledger Sync between your devices. If you want to review a specific step, you can scroll through the chapters below. Thanks for watching this Ledger tutorial. Please subscribe to our channel, and if you have any questions or comments, let us know. Till next time, stay secure.